Hey, this is Dale Calvert. On this video, I'm going to share with you what I absolutely know to be the number one network marketing opportunity available in North America for 2021 and I believe the next five years. And I'm not just going to share my opinion. I'm going to give you a lot of documented facts so I can explain to you exactly why this is the very best opportunity available in the marketplace today. If anything that I say does not make sense, it's not congruent, it cannot be backed up with facts, please feel free to call me out in the comments. If you can verify a lot of what I'm going to be sharing, I would appreciate your comments as well as we go through this presentation. Uh, I hope that you will listen to everything that I'm getting ready to share with an open mind, open heart. I, I believe that if you will, if you do, that for some of you, you're going to remember this presentation this day uh, as a crossroads in, in your business and your life that made all the difference in the world. So the first thing you should be asking yourself is, who is this person? Why should I be listening to them? Uh, again, my name is Dale Calvert. I've been involved in the network marketing pro profession at some level for over 40 years. I started in this little 600 square foot home. I was driving this beat up Chevette. I was a 20 year old snot nosed kid, didn't have a clue what I was doing. My sponsor quit two weeks after I joined. I didn't even know who my upline was. But a few years later, we were able to build this 16,000 square foot home on 100 acres in central Kentucky. Uh, that's myself there and a couple of our business associates. This guy actually is the uh, director of marketing today for a company called It Works. But I, I wanted to share this because right here, it's there's a little plaque. And the plaque says, never forget. This, this was an actual photo that hung over here in my office in this home. And it said, never forget. See, I remember, I understand why I came into this industry. I get it. I understand it. You can you can hear my whole story if you need to over at MLMHelp.com. It's called The Power of the Dream. You can access it over there just from a credibility standpoint. But I've had the privilege of, of working with and personally coaching some of the top leaders in this industry. Here's a few of them, and the list goes on and on and on. Uh, it's been an honor. It's been a privilege to work with so many awesome people and see them fulfill their reasons for getting involved in this profession. So, Dale, okay, what did you do? Well, to the left here is a picture of myself and our company owner during my big five-year run. This was the cover of Success Makers Magazine. We went from zero to $100 million in hotel sales in five years. Uh, I'm from a little town in Kentucky, population 400, Stamping Ground, Kentucky. And during that five-year run, we developed over 200 six-figure earners on our personal team and helped tens of thousands of families improve their financial life. Uh, it was unbelievable, unbelievable run. We went uh, in the top five network marketing companies for the year, two of those years. Again, you can learn more about me than you would ever want to know at DaleCalvert.com. But I retired from building teams at age 39 because I saw the profession back then starting to get away from the core fundamentals on which the on which the industry was built. I've always believed if you build people, people will build the business. And we started getting away from the personal development the holding people accountable. We started to appeal to mediocrity instead of inspiring greatness in people. And I just wanted to do other things. So I retired at age 39. That was 20 years ago. For the last 20 years, network marketing has been my bread and butter. I've had the opportunity to travel all over the world, teach our different concepts, ideas, systems for developing people and building teams, real teams of people that are progressing, growing, learning becoming and earning. Uh, but I tell you, it's been a battle because there's so many concepts and ideas that have become mainstream today in this profession that it that are not relevant to this profession. It just blows my mind. It absolutely blows my mind. We have so many gurus trying to teach people how to do that, which they have never done. It's amazing to me that, that people never stop and ask, who is this person? Why should I be listening to them? It's it's amazing. 
So anyway, long, long story short, uh, about six, seven weeks ago, uh, my wife and I had uh, a, a, have been having conversations and we just came to the decision that, you know, I have fought this battle for a long, long time. Uh, I've, I fought it that, you know, your personality is not duplicatable. People need systems that they can plug into. That's how the real world works. The real world works from developing homegrown leaders, from promoting from within. Uh, I, just a lot of the things that I saw the profession get so far away from and continue to just move further and further away from that has put us in a situation where the last couple of years has been, you know, two years where network marketing sales in, the, in North America have dipped, according to the Direct Sales Association. And I was just decided, you know, I've, I've given it a good fight for a long time and I'm just going to sell all my intellectual property. I'm going to sell all my the, the rights to all my training programs, all my network marketing related websites. There's about 15 of them. My Amazon business, the books and, the, and courses we have on Amazon, my three podcast, everything, all my intellectual property. I'm just going to liquidate and move in a different direction, which I'd already been moving in and already been participating in. My wife and I operate several different businesses uh, and and I'm just done. I'm, I'm done. Uh, let them, you know, let them continue to look for the foo-foo dust. Let them continue to listen to the wrong people. Uh, but I'm finished. I just can't do this anymore. Uh, so that was the decision. I had contacted one of the largest internet marketing business brokers in the United States, started that process, and I was done. It, I love the profession. I despise what it's become. I, I love it. I despise what it's become. It's the blind leading the blind. Uh and people have, you know, just it, it, it has changed so much that people forgot they aren't dreaming anymore. They're not looking to create financial independence. They're just trying to cover their auto ship every month. They think, well, I've covered my auto ship, therefore I'm a success. So anyway, that's where I was, guys, six weeks ago. Uh, and then, uh, as I said, my goal you know, this year we have we've spent tens of thousands of dollars investing in online businesses. These are the four that we bought this year, uh, right here. And I have fifteen or sixteen other income-producing websites that we that we manage and that we build out, or that we bought. Uh, there's some of them: uh, International Skateboarders Association, Save Your Bucks, Magic Every Month, and so on and so forth. But that was the direction I was going to move in because I love building businesses. I enjoy that. And I knew I could buy a business, build it up, flip it, triple my money. And I could do several of those every single year with a very small staff of people that I could hire and fire. I didn't have to worry about trying to build a volunteer army, which you have to in network marketing. And uh, I just that was the direction that we were going in. The reality is, if I'm true to myself, I love building businesses, but I love building teams more because in network marketing, there's a ripple effect. Uh, you have the chance to really make a huge impact in people's lives and their family and future generation. And in network marketing, there's no business model in the world that offers you the opportunity to really create time and money. You know, the three biggest benefits of network marketing are number one, the person you must become in order to maximize your upside potential, the personal development. And for that, you need teams and people in your life that will inspire you to greatness, not cater to your mediocrity, which has been done the last 20 years in this profession. So number one is the personal growth. Number two is the friendships you develop. And number three is the lifestyle that the residual income can provide. And I just pulled this slide from 
uh, you know, some of the top income earners in this profession. And you can see, you know, number 14 down here is making about $480,000 monthly. So it is true. It can be done. There's no question about it. Uh, but again, we've gotten so far away from inspiring greatness as a culture within the industry that uh, and just catering to mediocrity. You see so many companies now, they're just trying to add as many products as they can, even if they're not congruent to, to how they started, you know, adding crypto and travel deals and whatever they can find, not to take to the marketplace to produce profits, but just to sell to the distributors. Maddening. I can tell you the only reason that I'm here the only reason I hope you'll continue to listen to this, if you're truly looking to change everything, I mean, really fulfill your grandest upside potential in this profession. If there's anything I've learned in 40 years is all the stars have to line up and that doesn't happen very often. Uh, I missed A.L. Williams. I would say all the stars lined up for A.L. Williams. I missed Herbalife. I would say all the stars lined up for Herbalife, but it just doesn't happen very much. I've seen it happen maybe four or five times in 40 years where all the stars line up. And yes, there's been companies that come in this marketplace have phenomenal products, but their mark, their compensation plan stinks or their management didn't understand what it was like to be in the field and the emotions that field leaders have to go through. So there's the, all the stars have to line up. And quite frankly, I just didn't see it happening. I hadn't seen it happen uh, since probably NSA and uh, National Safety Associates when all the stars kind of lined up. What was that, 20 years ago? And so I'm done. I'm selling out. I'm selling my websites. I'm going to continue to support and love people the best I can, especially entrepreneur-minded people. But I'm moving personally in different directions and moving my business in different directions. And we're just making the pivot. And that's where I was. And then something drops in my lap that the, the stars had all lined up. I mean, every one of them. Not, not that a company that had huge upside potential. I'm not talking about potential. I'm talking about the stars had already lined up. And it's a very, very, very unique opportunity that I've never seen happen like this ever in 40 years. So I hope you'll pay real close attention and, and hear what I'm trying to communicate. Number one is the product. And in network marketing today, there's different types of product. There's some products that are based upon science, and there's some that are just manufactured and relabeled, uh, uh, you know, comp they, they find a, a nutrition line, a, 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 a skin care line, a personal care line, uh, household products, whatever, relabel them, find a comp plan, boom, they've got a company. They're all manufactured outside by another third-party source, a vendor, a vendor of some type. But there are some companies that have products based upon science. And, and if you have products that are based upon true science, that's an advantage. That's an advantage. That's one of the stars. So the company we're going to be talking about, you've probably never heard of. It's called APL Go. They just launched in the United States. They're less than two months old at the time of this recording. So what is the product? What's the science behind the product? The, the Dr. Earl Mendale, which many of you probably heard of, he wrote the Vitamin Bible. He did a, uh, wrote a book about the happiness effect, talking about the positive benefits of negative ions. You know, that's why when we go to uh, the mountains or the beach or we're around waterfalls, we feel good. We have an overall sense of well being. It's because of the negative ions that are projected in the air. There's even machines now, air filtration machines that project negative ions into your office or home. Many casinos use these negative ion machines. And I could go on and on. I'm not going to spend too much time. My only point here is the science behind the product is there. The product works. It's fabulous. People get instant 
gratification from these nutritional drops. What are you talking about, Dale? What's a nutritional drop? They look like this. They're little candies that when you take them, you can get an immediate gratification. There's 15 different drops, all based upon this patented negative ion technology. The company man manufactures their own products in their own facility. No third-party outsourcing. There's no competition at all in the profession for this product line. First and only of its kind. It's what we call a category creator. Usually when I'm evaluating companies, I can eliminate them real quickly because I see the red flags real quickly after being around this profession as long as I have. But this product is phenomenal. $40 a month auto ship, auto ship to start. Uh, so it's affordable for the masses around the world. The best compensation plan I have seen in 40 years. According to homebusiness.org, uh, they pay out 63%, right here, 63% to the field. Compare that with any mainstream, credible company in the marketplace. Now, I'm going to say something, and it, you can't, you have to experience it, uh, but it's not the fact they pay out 63%. It's the ingenious way in which it's paid that creates the highest income quicker, faster than anything I have seen in 40 years, period, end of story. And number three, and this is where many companies, it just doesn't work out because you have traditional business owners or people that have been involved in corporate America. They see the uh, return on investment, uh, cost of goods, sold versus returns, and they decide, well, I'm going to just start a network marketing company, and they decide if I build it, they will come. And I cannot tell you how many conversations I've had over the last 20 years consulting with good people, good intentions, but had no concept of what it really took to build a network marketing company. They thought they could just get some software and find a product and open the doors and the masses would flood to them. And they found out real quickly that it doesn't work that way. That's why you're seeing so many mergers and acquisitions of companies. They're merging together. You know, if you take two floundering companies and merge them together, all you've got is one big floundering company now. But regardless of that, the third thing and really important is the the management. Are they owned by a, a group that has to return profits to investors? So they start messing with the comp plan. Our owner, Sergi, uh, think about this. Think about, is there any owner in the world that would say this? This is from, again, an interview that he did. Sergi's goal is to produce 20 $1 million per month earners in the next year and a half. In a year and a half, it'll be the 10-year anniversary of this company, and that's his goal. But my thing is, what owner would say that? Most owners' biggest concern is how can we, how can we add more products so we can extract more money from our distributors and how can we keep everybody on auto ship one more month? Uh, many company owners feel that the distributors are a necessary evil to their, to their concoction that they're putting together. But he, it goes on in this article, he sa it says with, with amazing and unique products that taste great, low global price points, as well as low $40 PV monthly requirements. This is certainly possible. Sergi often says that network marketing runs in his veins, and we certainly agree. The guy started as a distributor when he was 17 years old. He understands that the distributors in the field build his company and write his check. Uh, the most inspiring corporate officer owner I have seen in 40 years. The guy's the real deal. He comes right from his soul. You can tell. Uh, he just does. And 
what owner would have the guts to say, I want to produce $20 million a month, million dollar a month earners in the next year and a half? None. Why? Because he knows he has the best comp plan in the in the industry, has the product and the price point and the science to make it happen. That's what I call all the stars lining up. Many of you watching this, you've been involved in phenomenal companies with great leadership, but they didn't have the compensation plan or the product or whatever, but all the stars are, must line up. And if it was just these three actors, I would still not be involved. I would be on my way to liquidating everything that I have in network marketing. This is the most significant idea that I want to share with you, and I want to make sure you don't miss this. Because most of you that see this, you're looking at th looking at it through USA startup glasses. You say, well, yeah, Dale, there's been awesome products, and I've seen comp plans that pay almost as good as this, and there's been great ownership. You're looking at it through USA startup glasses. This is the paradigm shift that you have to have. And please, I'm going to do my best, but for a second, open your mind and your heart and, and prepare for this paradigm shift because I missed it, honestly, when I first started evaluating this company. Yeah, it all looks good, but, you know, I've seen a lot of other things that have looked good before and had a lot of potential, but, you know, I, I'm not interested. I was, and I woke up at three o'clock in the morning and I saw, thought, Dale, you're, you're an idiot. You've met, you almost missed this. You almost miss this. You were looking at it through the wrong pair of glasses. Here's why. And this is what you need to understand. Track record. Track record. This is an eight-year-old European company. They have 252,000 distributors around the world. They're operating in 30 countries. They have 14 distribution warehouses throughout the world. Again, they manufacture their own product. This is not potential. It's track record. It's already happened. There's already six-figure monthly earners that have been created already in this business. So it's not potential. It's documented track record. It just launched in the United States. So it doesn't take a mental heavyweight to figure out what's getting ready to happen here. I heard a preacher one time, he said, if we, had a, if we all had crystal balls, we could all become millionaires. And I felt like standing on my pew and saying, no, no, we wouldn't. Not if we don't take advantage of what we see. I've shown you the crystal ball. The product, the comp plan, the ownership, and more important than anything, the track record. It's already happened. They just launched in the U.S. They've already done since they're since they started about you know two hundred fifty million dollars in business in the different countries around the world. So my question to all of you experienced network marketers is when was the last time you saw a company with this type of track record, this type of volume, wait eight years before they enter the U.S. market? He talked about him and his best friend used to think about one day we're going to take this company to America. Well, about a year and a half ago, Sergi moved his wife and three kids to Florida. He's been here about a year and a half getting all the, the documentation set up, all the the legal aspects of the business that are necessary, everything set up, moved to the United States, and now it's launched here. So the stars have lined up, ladies and gentlemen. The real question is not which opportunity in the market today is going to create the most millionaires in the next five years. I think that question is beyond obvious. The answer, I really do. Uh, because it's if you're paying out if you're working with a comp plan that pays back to the field 35 40 percent it's hard to compete with 63 percent if you're just looking at comp plans and again that's just one of the stars but the real question is do you have the ability to pivot 
See, some of you right now are, Dale, well, I'm really committed to what I'm doing. And I, I always ask, okay, how long have you been there? Well, I've been there for three years, Dale. Awesome. Why aren't you full-time yet? How much did you make last month? What is the culture of the company? Are they introducing new products every 90 days and giving the distributors a, another new little red wagon to play with? Does your ownership, is there a desire to help you become a million dollar monthly earner? Dale, I'm committed. I'm loyal. Okay. Are you making an emotional decision or are you making a business decision? And listen, I understand. I've been there. I, I fell in love with my first company, as many people do, the Shackley Corporation. I fell in love with it, and it caused me to miss A.L. Williams. I could have been the second Herbalife distributor in the state of Kentucky, and I missed it. Well, well, you didn't know what Herbalife was going to be. You would have jumped on it if you knew Herbalife was going to, or A.L. Williams was going to, you know, totally disrupt the insurance business. You would have probably been, yeah, I would. So what's the challenge? See, the challenge is we don't know where we are sometimes because the company has to progress and get down the road. And once it gets down the road five, 10 years, then we can look back and, and we see opportunity lost. But we didn't know what the future was going to be. So we hang on where we are. That's the point. Guys, the crystal ball is in front of you. You know what the future is based upon the past, based upon the eight-year track record of this company. You under, There's a big distinguishing factor here that just, I've never seen in 40 years. That, to have this type of understanding about what the true growth projections can be in the United States. So sometimes you just have to have the nerve and the guts to pivot. The real question is, are you going to take a serious look with an open mind? Because I know most people won't. Well, Dale, I'm just committed. Or I, I hear, Dale, I'm burnt out on network marketing. You know what? I don't blame you. I don't blame you at all. I was too. I was totally burnt out on network marketing. But, but ladies and gentlemen, I know the team culture that we create. I know what it takes to help people get from where they are to where they want to go. I understand the skill sets and the mindsets, and we're really good at teaching them to the right people if you're willing to do your part. Yeah, you were burnt out on MLM. That's because you were messing around with flunky programs with no team culture, no corporate culture, no, people just catering to mediocrity instead of inspiring the greatness that is within you. So you're burnt out, but you've never been involved in the type of culture I'm talking about. Or, and I know that you've never had the upside potential that I'm talking about because we're talking about something that's less than two months old at the time of this recording. And if you're watching this three years from now, it'll still be the best upside potential of anything that you've probably ever had the opportunity to be involved with. So burnout, okay, but that tells me at one point you were willing to take action, to step out of your comfort zone, to attempt to build your own dream instead of somebody else's. That's what it tells me. If you tell me you're burnt out on network marketing, I'm telling you, I've been there. After I left Shack, I said, I will never do anything ever again where my success depends upon other people. Most of the millionaires that I know in this profession at one point were burnt out and had promised themselves they would never do it again. But once you get the vision of what this can really offer from a residual income and time standpoint, it's hard to compare it to anything else out there. It really is. It's a great business if it's done right, if you're in the right place at the right time and you're with the right team and the right culture. So again, I don't blame you for being burnt out. As I said, I was liquidating everything. I was... I was done as well. So I understand. And it, I think it makes me so thankful that this came into my life at this point, because this was the last thing I promise you I'd expect it to happen. 
But Dale, I'm just so committed. And my team, my team is, I have to take care of my team. Listen, if if it's the best move for you to pivot based upon the stars lining up and the documented facts that I've shared with you, if it's the best move for you, why would it not be the best move for your team? But Dale, I don't just jump around from company to company. I'm not asking you to. I'm telling you, I'm telling you that if you're willing to do your part and you're willing to plug in, that you will never, ever, this will be the last network marketing company you ever join. The last you ever join. If you're willing to do the work, you're willing to plug in to the systems that we have in place that are working for people that are working. If you're willing to do your part, this will be the last company you ever join ever join. I believe this opportunity is worthy of your highest goals and your biggest dreams. I sincerely do. Uh, our team has a documented track record. Uh, our systems, our culture that we understand must be created of developing leaders. We understand what it takes to develop a leadership development culture. In network marketing, your long-term income is in direct proportion to the number of leaders that are developed on your team. You can inspire greatness or you can cater to mediocrity. We understand what it takes to help people that are willing to expand their comfort zone, take action, move forward, and progress monthly in their business. And we have the compensation plan and the product and the systems to make that happen. You know, this is a picture you're seeing of the company owner and myself. Uh, it was on the front of Success Makers magazine. And uh, that was a five-year run that was legendary. Uh, we went from zero to $100 million in sales in five years. Uh, my five-year goal here with our team is develop 500 full-time earners and 10 millionaires basically double what we did in the five-year run that we had previous, previously. That's my go. I believe it can happen. That's why I'm so fired up and why I'm doing my best to repel the wrong people, but to, but to tell the right people, look, if you're the type of person we're looking for and you want and you dream big and you came into this profession, not for a social club, not for friends, not so you could have a business card and hang out and tell your relatives that you have a business. But I mean, to really build something significant, to make a huge impact on your financial future, then I um, I'm hoping that you'll take the time and really get your questions answered and really take the time to understand what I'm sharing with you. The stars have lined up. So please get back with the member of our team that shared this video with you. Again, my, we're Don and Dale Calvert. Uh, been doing this a long time. Uh, we've got an exciting, exciting organization of people uh, that dream big and, and are so thankful as we are that this opportunity has come to us to us at this time and place in our life. I hope something I've said has inspired you to at least get your questions answered, take action, evaluate, and see if you would be a good fit for our team and what we're doing. We're not a social club. We're not rah, rah, rah. We're let's, let's inspire each other to greatness. Let's have systems that can be duplicated by the average person with above average skills for customer acquisition we have it that it's working. Let's let's show people play one, play two, how to recruit people uh, effectively by finding the right people at the right time in their life. That's what we're looking for. Uh, have any comments, questions you want to cuss at me or or whatever? Feel free to leave them in the in the comment section below. Again, this is Dale Calvert. Thanks for watching. Please. Contact the person that shared this video and say, how do I learn more? Do it right now. Opportunities never lost. Opportunities never lost. It's only taken advantage of by somebody else. I know what's going to happen with or without you. You really 
want to miss this. I believe some of you have been here, have been around this profession, and waited for this time and place your entire life. So don't let it slip through your hands. Get your questions answered. Thank you. God bless. This is Dale Calvert. Talk to you soon.